Hi there, I will just explain how to use these uh, fog snow and rain shaders. So we have imported a 2D scene from Unity samples. And here we have a, uh, we have our main camera here. So we will add our image effects to this main camera. So I I just select this main camera and come to its uh, inspector to its properties and uh, just uh, press the add component and type fog here and you can see there are two fog image effects one of them uses a noise texture to create the uh, foggy environment and other uh, just uses uh, some calculations but I will uh, use this uh, D2 fog image effects which, which runs much smoother and uh, these uh, values you can play with it. You can just change the fog color. Uh, you can just uh, change its size. You can think it as a zoom effect here. And we have a, a horizontal and vertical speed of the uh, mist. And this uh, is the density of the fog as you can see so let's run our game and see the effect so as you can see uh, the fog is just coming from right to the left because we have set our horizontal speed so let's make it something uh, 0 0.5 and I want this fog effect to come from uh, upper top corner to the left bottom corner so I will just put vertical speed too so I will put the same value to the vertical speed too and uh, as you can see we have a fog effect as you can see we can just increase the density a little much so if you uh, cannot get a uh, thick fog effect you can just duplicate this effect and you can uh, get a much more beautiful uh, foggy environment so what do I mean so let's make this size a little smaller okay. so let's copy this component from the upper right corner of the image effect so press the component and press again this settings icon and paste component again so as you can see it will just add an, another layer uh, to the scene so you can just uh, play with its color etc and you can create uh, a dirty fog effect something like this and you can just change the values a little bit uh, so you can just mix uh, the environment with other image effects so as you can see here we have a beautiful uh, misty screen here and let's make them smaller and I will add uh, another image effect which is snow and if you type snow here you will see our uh, snow image effect and as you can see it's just snowing around so you can uh, play with uh, particle count but it may just decrease your uh, frame per second so do not put very much what you see if you don't say uh, powerful uh, PC or device and this speed is as you can understand the speed of the uh, snowing so you can just set it according to your needs and this uh, direction as you can see it just uh, gives a snowing direction to the particles and so I will set uh, to negative value to just get this uh, upper top to the bottom left uh, effect like this 
and this zooming effect uh, just makes the particles smaller or bigger so you can set it according to your needs so as you can see we have a, just have a beautiful snow ring alignment and let's add our other image effect which is rain so if you type rain you will see these D2 rains image effect and it's uh, this rain effect uses a noise texture to create the rain so if you uh, press this little circle and type noise it, you can use this uh, color noise texture or if you have other uh, color noise texture you can use uh, them too but uh, in my uh, texture folders you can use this noise color uh, texture so as you can see just to miss the uh, rain particles so uh, this rain has uh, some similar values uh, like others uh, there is a density to just increase the rain amount or speed of the raining and this exposure uh, makes the visibility of the uh, raindrops if you give small values they just not clearly visible and this direction of course just uh, change the direction of the rain as you can see So let's see the effects along again. So I will just save the uh, snow and rain as you can see our fog effect. And let's save them and open our snowing effect. I'd like just save and enable our rain effect. And you can mix them according to your needs and uh, I hope uh, you can create beautiful games with these shapes.